Super Typhoon Pepito makes landfall in Aurora, bringing heavy rains, strong winds and deadly storm surge to Luzon. Super Typhoon Pepito, Nan Yi, made landfall in the vicinity of Depacula, Aurora, at 3.20 p.m. Sunday, packing maximum sustained winds of 185 km per hour and gusts of up to 230 km per hour, according to the Philippine Atmospheric, Geophysical and Astronomical Services Administration, PADASA. The storm has created a life-threatening situation for central Luzon as it moves northwestward at 20 km per hour, bringing heavy rains, damaging strong winds and coastal surges. Pagasa has placed several provinces under varying levels of tropical cyclone wind signals TCWS, with central Aurora under TCWS No. 5, which indicates strong winds and catastrophic conditions. Authorities have urged residents in vulnerable areas to evacuate as the storm poses an extreme threat to life and property. Residents of Aurora and neighboring provinces such as Quirino and Nueva Vizcaya felt the brunt of Pepito's strength. Pagasa warned that areas covered by TCWS No. 5, including Depaculao, Baylor, and San Luis, would face strong winds exceeding 185 km per hour, which could destroy homes, uproot trees, and down power lines. The storm's path crossed northern central Luzon, affecting the highland areas of Sierra Madre, Carabao, and Cordillera Central. Heavy rains and possible flash floods and landslides remain major concerns in the region, and Pagasa urged caution and preparation. Local officials in Aurora have mobilized disaster response teams, urging residents in low-lying and coastal areas to move to evacuation centers. Relief operations have been prepared to meet the immediate needs of affected communities. Pepito's landfall brings the threat of storm surge, with coastal waters expected to reach more than 3.0 meters in low-lying areas. Pagasa has stressed the danger to coastal areas in Ilocos, central Luzon, and metro Manila. Residents are advised to stay away from the coastlines, as rough seas make sea travel dangerous even for large vessels. A typhoon warning is still in effect, extending to the eastern and western coasts of Luzon. Mariners and fishermen are advised to remain in port until conditions improve. As Pepito passes through central Luzon, several provinces, including Nueva Ecija, Pangasinan, and Benguet, are under TCWS No. 4, indicating strong winds.